In this video, you will configure the 48 so that a newly created certificate can be used for SSL deep inspection of HTTPS traffic. You will create a certificate signing request, sign the certificate on the 40 authenticator, download it back to the 40 gate, and apply it to an SSL SSH inspection profile for full SSL inspection. You will apply an application control security profile with deep inspection of cloud applications enabled. For this to work, the 40 authenticator must already be configured as a certificate authority. On the 40 gate, go to System Certificates and select Generate to create a new certificate signing request, or CSR. Enter a name for the certificate, the public IP address of the 40 gate, and a valid email address. Set key type to RSA and key size to 2048 bit to make sure the certificate is securely encrypted. Then download the certificate. This will save a .csr file to your local drive. On the 40 Authenticator, go to Certificate Management, Certificate Authorities, Local CAs, and select Import. Select CSR to sign, enter an ID for the certificate, and import the CSR file created earlier. Make sure to select the correct 40 Authenticator Certificate Authority from the drop-down menu, and set hash algorithm to SHA-256, the latest secure encryption. The certificate has now been signed by the 40 Authenticator. Select the intermediate certificate and export it. This will save a .crt file to your local drive. Back on the 40 gate, go to System, Certificates, and select Local Certificate from the Import drop-down menu. Import the CRT file created earlier. Back in the certificate list, you should now see that the certificate has a status of OK. Go to Security Profiles, Application Control, and edit the default profile. Under Options, enable Deep Inspection of Cloud Applications. Go to Policy and Objects, Policy, SSL, SSH Inspection, and create a new profile. Enter a name, select your certificate from the CA Certificate drop down menu, and make sure inspection mode is set to full SSL inspection. Next, go to Policy and Objects, Policy, IPv4 and edit the policy that allows internet access. Under Security Profiles, enable SSL SSH inspection and select the custom profile created earlier. Enable Application Control 2 and set it to default. Open your web browser and attempt to browse to any HTTPS site. In this example, we will go to https www.dropbox.com. If you view the site's information, you should see that the certificate is issued by the FortiGate and has verified access to the site. Thanks for watching. If you'd like to see more videos like this one, click here to subscribe. You can also find a written version of this recipe at cookbook.fortinet.com.